Fair Championship for three-year-old trotting Colts and Geldings, $60,000. On the line, the winner takes home 30 grand. And let's meet the starters for this championship final. Number one is Life's a Holiday, owned by Homer and Jay Hochstetler of Crete, trained and driven by Homer Hochstetler. Number two is Fox Valley Saga, owned by Sally Watt of Carbondale, trained by Irvin Miller, Eric Ledford in the bike. Number three is M.A. Sparkle, owned by Hyla Doric of Lovington, trained by Irvin Miller. The driver is Ross Leonard. Number four, Hockhauser, owned by Dick Baylog of St. Charles, trained by John Bootenshane, driver Tony Morgan. Number five, Mystical Victor, owned by Mystical Marker Farms of Chicago Heights, Illinois, by Jack and Peggy Hood of Valparaiso, Indiana, trained by Dirk Simpson, Andy Miller in the bike. Six, Let's Get Ready to Trot, owned by Dale Adams of Paris, John David Finn of Newton, Brenda Watson of Fairfield, trained and driven by J.D. Finn. Number seven is Gum Corner Vic, owned by Ruth Burkett of Ellery and George Notmoose of West Salem, trained by Delbert Burkett, the driver, Connell Willis. Number eight, Trotton Tarzan, owned by John Leahy of Westchester, Illinois, Anderson Racing Incorporated of Crete, Illinois, by Neil Miller of Beverly Hills, California, trained by Joe Anderson, Ryan Anderson Drives. Number nine, Fox Valley Illusion, owned by Jackie Bootenshain of Marengo, Illinois, and James Crowley of Chicago, trained by John Bootenshain, Dave McGee in the bike. And number 10 is Uncle Pappy, owned and trained by Tom Graham Jr. of Salem. The driver, Dale Heitman. The State Fair Championship for sophomore trotting Colts and Geldings. The Six Illinois State, State Fair Colts Stakes. Championship time is here. We're an eighth of a mile from the start. Gates rolling. Somebody about to become $30,000 richer. Here they come. They're off and trotting. There goes Mystical Victor out for the lead. Let's get ready to trot. We'll try to go with him. Life's a holiday. Gets away in good order. Third down toward the inside as they hit the first turn. Fox Valley Saga comes away trotting in fourth. M.A. Sparkle ducks over toward the rail in fifth. Hockhauser moves by him on the outside, and there goes Life's a Holiday. Homer Hockstetler pulls the trigger and sends the favorite toward the front, midway on the first turn. From third to the lead in an instant, Life's a Holiday is on top. 28 and four, the time for the opening quarter. He leads it a length and a half to Mystical Victor. Let's get ready to trot. Fox Valley Saga, Hockhauser is next. The top five all go single file. Trotten Tarzan is sixth on the outside of M.A. Sparkle, who's now in seventh down toward the rail followed by Fox Valley Illusion, who starts moving up from the back. Uncle Pappy is next to last behind him, and Gum Corner Vic is trailing the field, racing 10 lengths off the lead. Life's a holiday. Goes by the half-mile mark, but now Hockhauser is moving up on the outside to challenge. He goes to second, the half in 58 and three. Life's a holiday, leads at three parts of a length. Hockhauser is keeping Mystical Victor pinned down toward the inside as the field moves on the turn. Trot and Tarzan into contention now fourth just two lengths off the, lead, off the lead he's on the outside of horses let's get ready to trot is next toward the rail then fox valley illusion on the outside of fox valley saga they're at the three quarter life's a holiday is there in 128 he leads it by a length and a half two lengths now mystical victor has been covered up all the way he's second trotten tarzan is still third on the outside the leader is at the eighth pole life's a holiday swings off the far turn looking for a state fair title leading mystical victor and hockhauser and let's get ready to trot hockhauser needs to find more quick mystical victor is pinned down life's a holiday hanging on no room for let's get ready to trot life's a holiday gets it three parts of a length close for a second either hockhauser or mystical victor 156 and one Homer Hochstetler just got a word of congratulations from wife Connie, and the result is official. Here is your newest Illinois State Fair champion, number one, Life's a Holiday, Homer Hochstetler. Trophy presentation will be made by Peggy Nolden, sister of Attorney General Jim Ryan.
and it goes to a three-year-old gelded son of Primrose Lane, bred by Connie Hockstetler, owned by her husband Homer, their son Jay, and Homer is the trainer driver. Life's a holiday now 10 for 12 in his career. Well, the whole crew is here. Homer Hockstetler, wife Connie, and son Jay checking over their state fair trophy. Homer, when you made that move down the first turn around the eighth pole, going to the quarter to go to the top, obviously it paid off, but what told you it was time to make the move right then? Well, I knew that uh, Dirk's horse probably would take a two-hole trip, and I wanted to be up close, but my horse really is better off the pace, but I knew my main competition was backaways, and I had him right where I wanted him in the last turn. And it paid off with a victory. Connie, were you nervous? Extremely nervous. <laughs> Almost nauseous. And I really want to say thank you to Mrs. Digert in a nursing home in Danville. If it wasn't for her, we wouldn't have Life's a Holiday because uh, she gave us the broodmare Quillow. So she really deserves a lot of thanks, too. Mrs. Beulah Digert, one of the grand ladies of Illinois harness racing she has been for a long, long time. Homer, Connie, Jay, congratulations. Go save the victory. Thank you very much. The Hockstetler family, ladies and gentlemen, the newest state fair champions.